As we have said before, the uniqueness of Curator is the combination of the logs or events with the flows and the asset database to produce remarkable uh, security intelligence. But some people out there are only interested and have budget for a log management solution, but they want one that is very simple to install and doesn't force you to have a PhD on the tool to do some basic forensic. And for that, we have our log management uh, solution. So if we click in there, we see actually the uh, you know picking up all the events as, as they come up, and uh, you have the possibility of actually look at this not only as uh, events come in real time, but you can say, well, give me all the events for the last hour, and you get the tool bang, give you giving you that, and you have the same zooming capabilities as we have seen before. Everything is very consistent across the tool. You learn it once, and it's intuitive. Uh, uh, for the rest of all the additional tools and you can actually uh, you know sort these by uh, for example log source you get the same data and as we can see most of the events are checkpoint uh, firewall uh, devices we normalize the data uh, so it doesn't matter whether uh, which brand of uh, firewall you are actually getting we have some guardian data as well in there um, you can actually uh, sort these by you know, uh, for example, by source IP, see who's the most talkative IP in your network. And here you get the top, uh, top 10 uh, IDs, and here you get the identity of, uh, you see, Karina Sherrill of, uh, of that individual. So, but you can actually have the possibility, I mean, the tool comes with, with a, a great deal of rule. Let's actually take a look at the rules that we have. And we see that uh, these are all the, the rules that comes out of the box. And we, for example, let's say that we want to uh, use this one, excessive firewall denies by a single source. And basically, notice how easy it is. You put those things in plain English with the, you know, and not uh, all those basic uh, information. And you can actually modify these. A rule and make it a base for another rule that you want to actually apply. But also, the tool comes with a tremendous amount of searches already out of the box. For example, you know, we can look at, uh, let's say, this Guardium view in here, and we see all the events that come from our Guardian appliance protecting our uh, database. And you can even create your own search. I can do, you know, for example, new search here. And I'm going to create one. And I can actually type in here. I'm going to use that Guardian one as a base for what I want to do. So if I type here Guardian, I get that Guardian view and I can click on it. And as we saw before, we can put in my dashboard if I want to. And I can actually modify, change the filters add filters, modify what 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 pieces of information do I see. It is that easy. So after you've done all those uh, all those searches, which is set set this up, you also need for compliance the reports. And this tool comes with more than thirteen hundred reports already you know out of the box. And they're not only for compliance, as you, we see here. But notice that they are for, you know, things like uh, antivirus and all sort of reports that are already available in the tool. And every, again, every report is nothing more than a search that you want to specify and the format uh, to be as a report. So let's take a look, for example, at uh, on the PCI. Let's see. PCI, scroll down here, and uh, PCI, here it is. Well, let me actually look at uh, a report here. Uh, this one, for example, might be a good one, 7.1. And here you see that you can actually edit the report and say when do you want to run it daily which days manually orally weekly you know and then you can even format the the what the layout of the report 
uh, you know you can actually modify this uh, the, the way you want and this is going to be the, the way that, they, that, that, that it's going to look like and let's take a look let's scroll here to the right and we have a report already uh, run so they actually run extremely fast let's uh, open that report and bring it here and this is how a report actually looks like so it is extremely easy to use easy to deploy you need a quick tool that is economical and good for compliance we have it for you